Super excited to be on location today. We're in Lackawanna County. I hear they got a dried meat crew up here, and we found a hidden gem. I hear there's a secret knock to get in the clubhouse. Let's see what they got going on. Whoa! What do we got here, Minja? We got dried meat, Mo, here. What are we starting with, the Lonzas? We're going to salt them up nice. So look at what he's doing. He's salting a Lonza. Is there a specific salt you use, dried meat, Mo? Yeah. The dollar store salt. How do you beat it? There you go. Dollar store. Dollar store containers. And that's Bring all it, huh? you need. How uh, long will you let these bad boys bleed for? Three days. We'll salt them every day for three days and drain them every day. I Try me, Mo. You mind if I cruise through? I see meat hanging everywhere in Try here. Do you mind? Yeah. What do you want to do, Joe? Oh, look at this. Watch your sassy, Joe. He's hanging them. That's right, Joe. You have to hang them, let them dry. Now, what off. do we got here? Are these six soup? weeks. Six weeks, they'll be ready. Whoa. Super sad. Yeah. Look at these nice. bad boys. Don't be drinking all that Dago over here. Man, yeah, let me get you. Ronnie! It's just Pizza Ron! Oh my god, we got a legend here today. Are you on the stove? Tell me you're making pizza fritters. What do we got here? A little super sad? Super sad. We're making sandwiches so everybody can taste. Now, no one can touch the stove in here but no. you. That's what they told me. That's right. Just us. Pizza Ron. It's, it's passed down, down from generations. That's I hope I don't find Doc swimming in this Dago. There's no way this is a Dago barrel. Doc, what are you doing, man? Yeah. here. Yeah, no, it'll drip for a minute. Yeah. This is my kind of clubhouse. Where can you get a Dago bath? For all you Italians that are looking for a spa day, come up to Dried Meat Mo's. You can soak in this and relax your hamstrings. This is a major wine operation. Oh, what a clubhouse, Doc. I'm not leaving. My family's from the Oregon section. Me, you, me and Doc got to figure out how Who's to get from the Oregon section? Oh, me. You're my from mother, the Oregon section? My mother's a Fashana. My, my, my grandmother was an Acapini. My, my grandparents grew up right Look at the town. operation they got going on here. My Typical my Italian my operation. Couple guys standing around. Couple guys talking family like they're the Smiths. And we got Dried Me Moat here doing his thing. What an operation. And there's the West Doc, provolone me with all this meat here. We need the sharp provolone fast. We don't even have knives up here. Me, yeah. Look at these guys. <laughs> Joe, here's the process. Meat seasoning in the no, grinder. No, no, no. You gotta come over. Comes out. Then it's important in the stuffer. The most important guy they say in this operation is the dick. Doc, come on. We're a family show. Cuzzy. The dick. It's the oh, stuffer. Oh, okay. Casing. Comes out. It's still wet and hot. Poke it. Dry it. Hang it. Balducci, they say you're right from Italy and you're the only one that can slice the meat. Hey, I could have cut a meat of good. All right, let's see what you got. Is this your meat? Look at the... You like my meat? Oh, my God. Look at that. Look at how the meat came out from their super satas. Unbelievable. This is their lonza. Doc, what do you think? Try it. The guy's a professional. He sliced this so thin, there's only one side. Oh, man, yeah! Oh, you have room? Go this way. Oh, you really don't see this a lot of places, but this is what life's all about. Friends and family coming together, keeping the tradition alive, and making sure that they're settled for the whole year with their own dried meats. <laughs> Dried meat mo, thank you for having us in your clubhouse today. Obviously the meats are hanging. This is the artistry. Everybody says you're really skilled once they're hanging. So now that they're hanging, what do you have to do? Well, Joe, we get the meats off of Johnny Marazzi, Marazzi's provision. What we do is once they're done and cured, we hang the towel so they don't get a draft. Okay, so hanging the towel across the all whole... All around, we'll, we'll close the whole thing because they got to cure from the inside out. Okay. They get a draft work. 
These get hard and they cure from the outside in and they go bad. Wow, so they have to go from the inside out or they'll be bad. Then you lose a couple thousand, you know what I'm wow. saying? Wow. A couple thousand dollars of meat. So what's the temperature you keep these at? I like to keep it a little bit under 50. And how long will you keep them at that? About nine to 10 weeks. And is this just straight penicillin? People think that's small, nope, but it's actually that's, that's penicillin. That's the, the intestine from the cow, the casings. Okay, that's the casings. That's the so casings. So you use real casings, yes, right? Yes, not synthetic. Okay. And these will hang for how long? About nine to ten weeks. Nine to ten weeks, and then they're done. You can just pull them and eat yeah, them. Done. Cut them. You take the skin off and the casings. Well, dried me moat. Thank you for having the Goombas here today. This has been an unbelievable clubhouse. We're happy we came to Lackawanna County. And Doc, as always, what are we looking for? We're looking for gardens.